Hello, my brilliant mathematicians. Today, we're going on another subtraction adventure. But this time, we'll use something very helpful called a number line. It's going to make finding out how many we have left after we take away so much easier. Are you ready to learn how? Let's dive in. First, let's remember what a number line is. It's like a long ruler with numbers that help us count up or down. I remember the number line, Miss Julie. We used the number line table and we drove back and forth on it. That's right, Lily. Like we said, using a number line is like going on a journey through numbers. Today, this journey would make us go backwards. Let's jump right in. For this lesson, we'll be using the number line table again. So, if I say 7 minus 3 or 7 take away 3, we start at 7 on our number line and then we drive back 3 times to find out what's left. 1, 2, 3. So what number do we have? We have 4. 7 minus 3 equals 4. Perfect. Now let's try another one together. How about 9 minus 6? I'll do it. Since we want to take away 6, I'll drive backwards 6 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And now we're at the number 3. 9 minus 6 equals 3. Alright, now let's solve some real life puzzles. Are you ready? Yes, Miss Julie. Now, Lily, if you had 12 sweets and took away 5, how many sweets would you have left? Since I want to take away 5, I will drive backwards five times. One, two, three, four, five. And we have seven. Twelve minus five equals seven. I will have seven sweets left. Great, Lily. Now, Noah, if you have 17 cookies and you eat four, how many cookies will you have left? All right, I'll start at 17 and then drive back four times. One, two, three, four. Now I am at 13. 17 minus four equals 13. Well done, my mathematicians. You all did so well today with the number line. Remember, subtraction is like hopping back on our number line to find out how much is left. You can practice this with any number and it's a great way to solve problems quickly. Keep practicing and soon you'd be subtraction superstars using the number line whenever you want. See you on our next math adventure. Bye!